this is the unboxing and first impression of the iJoy Blast and it comes in the box depending on where you buy it from it comes in the box uh, sometimes covered in the plastic like this which you can take out uh, some stores have it in the plastic like this some have it just without that just a straight box and they usually have a seal over here over here and the opening area the tab which I already took out so let's get straight to the unboxing of this um, iJoy Blast this is how the side of it looks and as I turn it you can see this is how it looks This is from out of the plastic. Here's the iJoy Blast. So let's unbox this as we are going to do it. It's the tab here. Take out that, open this. And we have our product that's in here it has a little jog wheel it's already probably pre-charged by the way this is also rechargeable so it's probably pre-charged so you take out this and this comes right out by pulling this out and I don't think anything else is in there other than the power supply. So let's take that out. So. so it has a audio cable, the 3.5 pin. So you can connect your older devices to it. Um, so you can connect the older devices that has the 3.5 pin. And there's nothing else in there. So this is how it looks on the top. As you can see, it has a SD card slot, which is also known as a TF card, which is micro uh, TF card. It has the auxiliary input, mic input, and it has all the scan mode off and on. It has a DC volt for charging. It has also a USB port for putting your flash drive in. And this is that jog wheel for your volume control, I guess. And this is how it looks. And as I showed earlier, it comes with this um, USB cable and a 3.5 pin. So it has a USB cable for charging. So this is what you will be using to put in here for the DC volt, for the DC 5 volt. So we're putting it in there and you can select all your modes and scan on off, put your SD card micro, micro SD card in there, which is a TF card. You have your auxiliary, which that cable goes in. So this is the cable that goes in it. So this is how it looks when it is taken out. And I'm going to show you guys more of this. So this is how it looks. In this packet, it comes with a little manual. Okay, so as I showed you guys, this is how the front looks and I'm going to turn the power on. 
uh, don't forget to uh, look at your manual before using it so this is how it looks uh, one final thing I'll be showing you guys on top so you can even uh, put a quarter inch mic in here this is your auxiliary for all your music and everything else you can put you can also put your music from your uh, TF card which is also known as the micro SD card you can also put the USB flash drive so it has all different modes you can select by using this button so this is how this looks so you can see it has the forward button scan play pause reverse on off so let's go and turn this on to see how it looks so this is where you will be hitting the button to turn on and there that's the sound it makes and you have all these lights flashing so it's already pre-charged a little bit from the factory so you can change the light color I guess too it's right now in blue mode um, but I guess you can change it and this is how it all gets lighted up so we are going to connect our uh, Bluetooth and see how it sounds we're going to connect a device and see how it sounds so now that it is paired we can see how it sounds uh, we're doing a sound test but uh, I'll let you know if it is good loud uh, if only one is worth it or you can even do two so basically you can have two of these uh, paired into another one so you can get a full stereo effect and even more of a sound so you can pair two blasts uh, together so you can use one as a master one as a slave if you have a second one so that capability is also in here uh, it can be connected uh, together as far as it also shows on the box a picture of that that you could pair uh, it's um, true wireless compatible that's what they call it so it's uh, true wireless compatible so you can have two of these playing through one device so that's basically it so let's now test and play something and see how it sounds so I've just connected my device and device connection is not that hard it is very easy it gets into pairing mode as soon as you turn it on and uh, it you know you just have to activate the Bluetooth on your um, device and it senses the device and they can pair each other fast and when it pairs it will give a beep so that's how you know that it has paired so we're going to test and see how it sounds um, with all the songs and everything so we'll play songs we'll play dialogues we'll play everything to see how it sounds it was weird Pick it up. The legacy of that shield is complicated, to say the least. That shield should be destroyed. This world is ours. You're never gonna stop. So that's your volume control right there. It's pretty loud. It's quite loud. Uh, it's not very bassy, but it is quite loud. I'm not sure if you can hear it but it is quite loud so here we go we're gonna try some
de mi mar y yo soy el metal Me voy acercando y voy armando el plan Solo con pensarlo se acelera el pulso Oh yeah, ya, yeah, ya me está gustando más de lo normal Todo mi sentido va pidiendo más Estoy que tomarlo sin ningún apuro Despacito, quiero respirar tu fuego despacito Deja que te diga cosas al oído Para que te so it is not bad it is quite decent i'm also going to play a different language uh, of me singing the sound is quite loud it is loud but not like a professional sound home theater system kind of loud but it is loud you can hear it uh, it has a little kick to it, but not too much like a professional uh, home theater or like a professional speaker system. So it is actually very good. Um, let's try something else and see how it sounds of uh, a different kind of music of me singing. But I want to dance and play But I want to dance and play So we are going to try also some Bollywood numbers uh, and you will have the audio sound of that also coming in so you can hear how it sounds. <laughs> Sorry for the Bluetooth uh, connection. There is a Bluetooth connection from the device. We're using an older device. So probably the older device uh, has a connection problem with the Bluetooth, but I will update that in the bottom of the video in the description. Also, when you select this, um, mode button you can go from the right here you can go from the main bluetooth for external devices or you can do the radio and then it has the line in which is for the auxiliary right here it has a line in for that and here the mic so you have to just play with it and you'll be able to see so this is the stuff that it has with it built in when you press the mode button and you can actually get this um, iJoy iBlast depending on from where you buy uh, between 40 and 50 bucks uh, so it's $40 to $50 um, and it's not bad it's quite decent um, you're not gonna get a professional speaker sound where uh, it's like a home theater or anything yeah it has its own tweeters they are right there so they have one there one there they have one down there and another one down there and these are probably like a mid and bass so it's quite loud it is it's loud uh but it's not bassy kind of loud where like a professional system so i hope this review helps if it did please click on the bell icon to get notifications of all my future 
uh, product reviews and impressions, uh, first impression basically. And also subscribe so you can be in the know of what's going on in my channel for future product reviews. So please don't forget to click on the bell icon and subscribe button. And thank you for watching and hope this video was helpful.